In this video, I will show you how to create a Discord server. So let's jump straight into it. So here we are, as you can see on Discord. Now to go ahead and create a new server, what you're gonna to want to do is come to your server list on the left-hand side. Now, if you look towards the very bottom, you're gonna see this plus icon, which says to add a server. So what you wanna do is click onto this, and that's gonna bring up a pop-up window like this. So from here, what you're gonna to want to do, you can either use a template. So if you're creating like a Discord server for gaming or like a school club or something like that, you can see some pre-made templates here. However, if you want to make a server from scratch, just go up and click the option to create my own. Now, what it's gonna do is ask you to tell us more about your server. Is it for yourself and your friends or for a club or community? This is completely optional. You don't have to answer this. If you don't want to do that, if you look towards the bottom, you can see this blue link here, which says skip this question. So give that a click. Then what you can do is go ahead and give your server a name and a picture. So you wanna click onto this and you can upload a picture from your PC. So for now, I've just gone ahead and use this picture and I'm just gonna call my server name test321. Once that's done, come down and press the blue create button at the bottom. And just like that, it's gonna go ahead and create your server. So from here, what you can do is invite your friends by clicking this button here. And it's gonna give you an invite link, which you can send to your friends to invite to your server. You can also see other things you can do. For example, personalize your server icon with an icon, which we've already done, so we've got to take there. Then you can go ahead, send your first message, and you can also do things like add apps and things like that. But that's a quick overview on how to create a Discord server. So with that being said, I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I'd really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like, and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial, and I will see you in the next video.